Hi, welcome to today's haul. So you were probably expecting my first Black Friday haul to be from like Right Stuff or something. But to be honest, I haven't found anything that really stuck out to me yet in their winter sale. So that will be coming later if I see something I like. But I did see that Target was having buy two get one free on manga. So I just decided to order some. I didn't know how good the packaging was going to be or anything. I didn't even know Target sold manga. So I just ordered six volumes, I believe. So I got two for free. This packaging is kind of interesting. So let me see. So the first thing I got is this blank canvas, my so-called artist journey, and I got one through four, and I believe that there's five volumes, but for some reason volume five was like more expensive than these ones. So yeah, this one, I it just caught my eye. I'm pretty sure that this artist is the one who did princess jellyfish and i think it is kind of like an autobiographical type thing about her journey and like becoming a mangaka or something like that her art is beautiful and i really enjoyed princess jellyfish and i know she has a couple other series but yeah and so i just decided to pick this up and if i like it i'll be picking up the fifth volume from somewhere else and they came in okay condition i mean that packaging as you saw was not the best but i'm pretty happy with this but these are a lot thinner than i imagined Okay, so next we got the second volume of Beastars. Um, if you've been watching my channel for a while, like my anime videos, you know that I recently watched Beastars and all my friends rave about the manga saying it's a lot more in-depth than the anime. So I decided to pick up volume two. They had volume two and then six through eight. So I was about to pick up six through eight as well, but like I said, I wasn't too sure about Target's manga. So that's why I just decided to get two. And then I ordered one through another website, but this turned out to be a pretty good deal. Like I ended up getting this for like $7 and these are a little bit expensive. This is normally $13 and I know even on like right stuff, they're usually like 11, 10 to 11. So I'm happy with this and I didn't want to jump the gun and get six through eight in case like I didn't like the manga or the art or something. So that's why I only got two. I mean, it's basically about animals that can talk, but it's in a high school setting and it's a lot about like the dynamics of like the trophic pyramid and yeah, there's drama, there's mystery, there's little romance. So yeah, this is, um, I'm not sure if this is rated mature, but it has some like more mature themes and topics. And lastly, I got this one, Our Dining Table. This just looked interesting from what I saw. It's apparently shown an eye, but it seems like just a cute like slice of life type thing. And this one was the one that came the most damaged. But yeah, I think I'm going to save this for a day when I'm not feeling so good and I just want something cute and cheery to pick me up. Like I'm not huge into like yaoi or anything like that. So I tend to find myself gravitating more to like nice, like calm stories like this. Like my favorite shonen eye series is dokusei if you know that it's like not nothing explicit or anything like that so i just like cute like soft slice of life type romances and this is just a one shot i believe and it was kind of expensive on right stuff uh, this is 14 dollars, and it's not that thick of a volume but i mean like i said i it was the buy two going free so i got this one so this is everything I got and overall Target was pretty good to me. Like I ordered these on I think Cyber Monday and it is Thursday so it came pretty fast and like this one on the listing the picture was like black and white like it was not a picture of the cover so I was kind of taking a risk doing this like it just had the title and the author so I'm glad that this is the right thing that came. And yeah so the other Black Friday deal that I purchased so far is from Books A Million. They were also having a buy two get one free so I think I ordered 10 volumes because one was like didn't apply for the sale for some reason so I got 10 and this is my first time ordering from them and I'm kind of sussed out like they had really bad reviews but I saw a couple other people's hauls where it turned out okay so I just decided to take a chance and get it and like they've been sending me these notifications that like one book has shipped and then like another book has shipped so like I don't know if they're sending them all in different packages I don't know if that's normal but yeah so that'll be my next haul or I'll just include it in my collective haul depending on when I get stuff because some things did say they were like gonna be in stock next week or something so I just assumed they would all keep it until everything came and then ship it all at once but I guess that's not how they work so stay tuned for that and then yeah like when I see something finally on the right stuff sale that I actually want I'll probably film a video like of me looking through the stuff like I've been keeping an eye out each week and nothing has like caught my eye a lot like the first week I think I was gonna get banana fish but then they were like sold out of the one through five bundle so then I was like uh, okay I don't want to wait plus I didn't know that you could still order stuff even when it said like out of stock or incoming stock so yeah I gave up on that and then the next two weeks I like was right on it and yeah nothing caught my eye so so yeah thank you for watching I hope this was okay a short video uh target gets like 
This packaging was kind of whack, but everything came in decent condition and I'm glad I got some good deals on some something I've been meaning to check out with, which is B-Star, something cute that I saw and then blank canvas. This just seemed really interesting and I really look forward to reading this. I'm not sure if the deal is still going on, but a few other things I saw that caught my eye was Cross Game, which is a baseball slash romance manga, but they're omnibus and they were kind of expensive. And then I'm not sure what else I had in my cart. They had Boku no Hero, but only some like weird random numbered volumes, like two and then like 20 and stuff like that. So this is what I picked up. I'm really happy with my purchase and thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. I forgot to mention this, but it was pretty hard to navigate Target's website. Like, so I saw that they were having buy two, get one free on like games, manga, comics, stuff like that. So I didn't know what they had. So I just searched up manga and like, I think, I believe I went to right here where it says sort by relevance to featured. And that seemed to kind of help. Like you can see Berserk and Arrow Manga Sensei, I Am Hero. It looks like they're having a sale, spend $20 and get $5 off. But yeah, it was a process. It took me, I think, about over an hour just to find some things. Because like, I didn't really know what to search for. And even if you go to the subgenre and put like comics and graphic novels, it didn't really help. Yeah, it, it was just like, a. it's really disorganized and... So what I ended up doing was like just searching a bunch of titles that I had been looking at, like, like for example, if you search up B stars, nothing co even comes up. Okay, I guess <laughs> I guess it was all sold out in the sale then. Um, like Boku no Hero. Oh, okay, here we go. So it doesn't even come up with the manga. Like it was just. Let me just look up Naruto. Okay, with Naruto, you got some merch and stuff, because, like, this is Target, not a bookstore, but, yeah, like, I, I don't understand how this was- how I even fi found stuff, like, this was just really irritating to navigate, but I did it somehow. How- did I miss all these stars? No, like, I know one I saw when I was searching was Dreamin' Fun, the shoujo manga? And it just comes up with some random books. I don't think- I guess I was searching for longer than I remembered because- <laughs> Yeah, but they had some like really obscure titles and like not- Ooh, okay. Here we go. Here's one I recently viewed. This was a novel. They also had I Want to Eat Your Pancreas, the novel. And then I think I like kind of went from like the suggested just to find what they had. Like, okay, they have five centimeters per second. Which is also a novel, I believe. Not manga. They have keys it. One of the Monogatari series. See, like, they have these really, like, not super popular series. And then... I'm trying to find, like, just straight up manga. I don't know, folks. This? Oh, yeah. And then sometimes when I search things, it would come up with, like, the DVD or something. So I didn't know they sold DVDs either. Yeah, they had like a silent voice and like these popular movies. I don't know if everything was sold out in their one sale, but I I doubt it. What the heck? They got Citrus, the Blu-ray. <laughs> wow, okay. Let me see if I can go to my order and then go find it from there. Okay, so it says the product is not available. Did they, did they just take all their manga out? This is the weirdest thing. Okay, so I guess don't buy it from... <laughs> product not available. Okay. Uh, this was a fail then. Ignore this.